What's up YouTube? It's Joel with your stimulus check and news update. There are new changes to the child tax credit ahead of the filing season in 2022. And there is new eligibility for the $1,400 stimulus check. The child tax credit increased from $2,000 per eligible child up to the new total of $3,000 or $3,600. The credit is now fully refundable, which is new and the advanced payments that people have been receiving since July are not taxable. If you had a baby that was born in the year 2021 and you did not receive a $1,400 check for your baby, that baby is eligible for a $1,400 stimulus check as well as the $3,600 child tax credit if no money was received in 2021 for that child. If you were supposed to receive a $1,400 stimulus check and you didn't, when you file your taxes, you can use the recovery rebate credit and get a larger tax refund in the amount of the stimulus check you were supposed to receive for yourself or a family member. This can be claimed when you complete your 2021 tax filings. The child tax credit is $3,000 per eligible child unless the child is under age six and then that amount goes up to $3,600 per eligible child. This is an increase from $2,000 per eligible child of any age where this credit is now fully refundable. There was an advance payment for taxpayers that claimed an eligible child last year and that's where the monthly checks came into play for that tax credit. These advance payments started in July for those that had timely filed. Now payments were anywhere from $250 per eligible child to $300 if the child was under age six in 2021. Now the great thing about these checks is that they are not taxable income. You will not need to repay if you receive any advance, but do not claim the eligible child this year. Claiming your dependent with another parent then the parent that claimed the child in 2020 will have gotten the advance. This will not be distributed again. However, the remainder of the credit will be available to the parent claiming the child when they file their taxes in 2021. You will need to know how much you received during the year in 2021 when you file your 2021 taxes. The IRS will be issuing form 6419 this will tell you your 2021 stimulus payment received as well as any advanced child tax credit forms. Now this is a super important form and should be treated like a W-2 or a 1099 when you receive it. Please keep it with your important tax records for the filing season of 2021. If you misplace it, you will be able to check your direct deposits on bank records or the IRS has stated they will be creating a portal to look this up. However, the IRS prior experiences, these websites can be hard to navigate. I would use it as a last resort. So ultimately, you should keep the letter that you received from the IRS. Most individuals should get their documents by February 5th and investors get them by March 15th. The Biden administration is looking to make this permanent to combat child poverty and make sure American families have the necessary funds they need for their family. If you like this video, please like and subscribe. Turn on the notification bell to stay up to date on all stimulus and economic news. This is Joel with your life investing. Until next time, 